Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. My name is Andrea with Foodimentary Adventures in Food. Our channel is all about the food. We do taste tests, recipes, grocery hauls, and what's for dinner. And I am here today with a fill-in haul from Aldi. I hadn't been there in a while and there were a few things that I wanted to pick up specifically from Aldi. And I just decided to show you guys everything that I picked up. So if you're new to our channel, uh, you might not know that Howard and I are in the middle of a freezer and pantry challenge. We have a sweet little baby on the way in January and we are trying to, well actually me, I'm trying to cut back on cost and um, just do a better job of just, you know, not spending so much at the grocery store. I love to grocery shop and um, I just realized that I was overdoing it in that department and really needed to eat what we already have on hand. Plus, I needed to make space in my cabinets for the baby's things as well. And um, the reason that I say the cabinets is because we do have a pantry but it's very small, so I have a lot of food in our cabinets as well. So I'm just trying to get through that and you know, just make more space. So we did need a few things from Aldi, so let me just jump in and show you what I picked up. So I got two bags of the super, queet, super <laughs> sweet corn. We really like this corn. It is um, microwavable and it was 79 cents a bag which is way cheaper than, you know, like the, the name brand corn, 12 ounces. And then we really like these extra fried green beans as well. I got two bags and they were, let me show you, let me tell you actually, um, $1.65 a bag. And the way that I prepare these is I just stir fry them in the skillet. I put in a little olive oil, um, of course some seasonings and um, I just stir fry them. So two bags of those. And then I have been craving salad. So I picked up a bag of butter lettuce. Um, this was $1.99. And we're probably gonna have um, like a fried chicken salad um, coming up soon. So I picked that up. And then I wanted to try their bone broth. It looked pretty good to me. Um, so I picked up the bone broth and it was $2.99. And then I like to have dry roasted peanuts on hand, unsalted specifically. I do prefer just to snack on these unsalted peanuts, but then with you know Christmas and um, you know Thanksgiving coming up, I do a lot of baking, and most of my recipes call for unsalted peanuts. So that's why I grabbed a bottle of them, and they were $1.89. Now, I did buy these um, caramel, apple, um, caramel dip little individual snack packs. That was kind of um, on impulse. Um, I will say, you know, I know it would have been much cheaper just to buy a bag of apples and some dipping sauce, but sometimes convenience is, just the convenience of something is worth it for me. So you get five individual packs of the caramel um, dipping sauce and the Granny Smith apples, and they were $5.49. Same thing with these little individual snack packs. Um, they are, let's see, you get the pepper jack, pepper jack cheese, raisins, honey, roasted peanuts as well. Uh, you get three little packets, and they were, um, how much were they? Sorry, I'm trying to find them on my receipt. $2.49, so that wasn't bad at all. And then I just needed some green onions. I really like having green onions on hand. I like to use them in scrambled eggs or just with dishes, period, just to add a little pop, so I have that. And then I also picked up some um, chive and onion cream cheese spread. Two boxes or two little containers of it because one of them is going to be for a crock pot meal they were $1.49 each. And the other one, I just like to spread the cream cheese on like a butter cracker and then have some um, like turkey or ham with it, like lunch meat as a quick snack. So that's why I picked up two of those. I needed some brown gravy. Um, I love to make Mississippi pot roast and I was completely out of the gravy packets that I needed for that. And um, so I picked up that and it was 29 cents. 
And then, let's see here, I picked up this Philly cheesesteak um, dinner kit. Of course, I didn't need it at all, um, but it just looked good to me. Philly cheesesteak, yum. So I picked that up, and I think that was $1.89. And then I also saw this double chocolate premium brownie mix. They had several different varieties. I think they had a salted caramel and something else, I don't remember, but this one sounded the best to me. So I picked that up and it was $1.69. And I also needed some chopped pecans, $4.99. Again, I do a lot of baking during this time of year and I was running low on them. Gonna be making chili pretty soon. I needed some chili beans, they were 55 cents. We needed some distilled water. Um, we both use sinus rinses and so I just needed that. And then I just grabbed some boxes of Juicy Juice. They were $1.99. And I just like to have those on hand as well. So anyway, this is what I picked up from Aldi. Just a few things as you can see. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. If you wanna see what some of our um, pantry and dinner challenges are, I hope that you'll subscribe to our channel. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you guys next time.